Yo, so Thailand just got several new species of pit vipers described and we have been looking for that and I have a video for that but before I show you that I wanna apologize for my last video of course it was an April Fool's Day joke but I know some people unsubscribed but I thought it was very funny but before the video remember if you like my content please like and subscribe that helps a lot anyway here comes the video Yo YouTube! So, Thailand just dropped several new species of pit vipers and one of them is uh, actually found pretty close to Hua Hin so I'm waiting for Victor and Anastasia and we're gonna go look for it so yeah it's gonna be awesome. Alright so we're at the spot now and uh, here is the gang. Here we have uh, Victor, Anastasia and uh, Anton. Are we not the only one? Oh shit, someone is here. Alright, so weirdest thing happened. Just as we arrived, we met some other herpers and uh, they already found our target. So here it is. The new species of uh, Trimersaurus of Thailand. So until recently this was uh, believed to be the beautiful pit viper, Trimersaurus venustus. But recent studies showed that this is actually a species of its own. Trimercerus criensis and they do look very similar. I don't get very good video on this with this background But yeah, they look very similar, but apparently the DNA is different. So yeah, here we have it It's a very nice species, but this is a very dull individual, so we're gonna try to find a more vibrant one because they can have very nice colors. I think this is going into shed. Here you can see it a bit better. Uh, I just moved it to the rock where it was found. Super nice little face. <laughs> Super cute snake. But yeah, we're gonna keep on looking and uh, hopefully find our own because this was a bit cheating. <laughs> So these snakes, just like all the Venustus lookalikes, uh, typically are found around limestone walls. So yeah, we're gonna search around this wall and there's also a big cave we're gonna explore. So hopefully we'll get some more snakes and I really hope for some other species as well. I guess we can find cave racers and uh, yeah, some other species. Some cave exploring. Victor is down to look at that frog, <laughs> but I'm here for snakes, so I'm staying up here. <laughs> Such a cool spot. We walked through that cave and uh, now we're here where we are surrounded by the mountains. It's just a small area surrounded by mountains. Very cool. And it's perfect habitat for the snake we are looking for. Usually they sit on sticks and stuff uh, along the rocks and uh, hunt for geckos and uh, Victor actually found their favorite food. I'm gonna show you. Oh, very nice little gecko and uh, this is what the pit viper is primarily eating. Small geckos. Oh my god, look at that little owl. There you can see it. I think it's some kind of scoops owl. Very cool. Ah, so bad video. Yeah, there you can see it a little bit better, but not very good, but super cool little owl. <laughs> It doesn't seem scared at all. Super cool. All right, so I found another one and this is a way brighter one, so beautiful. Here you can see how pretty they can actually be. Super nice one. Mm. And now it's not cheating anymore, now we found it. <laughs> oh, you can see it's a 
a small male. Oh. Wow. It's in here. <laughs> Angry little little guy. Did it try to bite? <laughs> I didn't see. Nice. Yeah, this this one does not wanna collaborate. <laughs> You can see how it has white lines on its face, and that's how we know it's a male. Super nice one. Ooh. Yeah, this... <laughs> Worst pit viper ever to take photos of. <laughs> it doesn't want at all. <laughs> Super nice. Just as we were taking photos of that one, I looked here and I found another one, and uh, yeah, it's another male, also a very small one, so super nice, now we've seen three, found two by ourselves. Weirdest shit just happened, I felt something crawling inside my shoe, and I got <laughs> super paranoid, thought it was a snake, but it was this little guy. <laughs> super cute. Victor is there, taking photos of the snake. Oh, I found the cobra. <laughs> king cobra. No, it's not the king. It's uh, a <laughs> queen cobra. <laughs> Apparently there's monks in the caves here, so we cannot explore the caves. So we're gonna go to another spot and uh, hopefully we're alone there instead. All right, so at the second spot. All right, so here we are. The habitat here is so nice. Incredible. Such a cool spot. I really like this habitat with this big beautiful limestone wall next to the jungle. Such a cool area. Wow. Oh, come and look at the, uh, at this. Oh no, it's it's, it's a big uh, I don't know the name. Whip scorpion or something? No? Look at this one. It's huge. Oh, it's Frina. Oh, it ran away. Super cool little cave. I wonder if... Nah. Doesn't look like it leads anywhere. Whoa. It's beautiful. Unfortunately, that cave was a dead end and uh, I'm really hoping we find some other species than just a pit viper because it was a four hour drive to get here. So, yeah, I really hope we get something else at least. Look at that little frog. I have no clue what it is, but super cool. And oh, 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 oh. If anyone knows what it is, please leave a comment. Just found another cave. Oh yeah, very nice, but cannot reach in very deep here. Wow, it's so beautiful. Whoa.
Okay, so we didn't get any more snakes at this spot, so we're gonna start driving back to Huahin. It's still a four hour drive home, 